Hey guys, in this video, I will show you how you can fix uh, Call of Duty Modern Warfare or Warzone uh, crashing or on startup and not launching. So, without further ado, let's get started. First of all, make sure that your operating system and your GPU drivers is fully updated. Uh, first, you just need to go to settings, then look for Windows Update, then here check for updates, and if there is an update for you that you need to download and install it, please do so uh, as well as your uh, GPU uh, depending on what GPU you're using I'm using Nvidia so there is an app called GeForce Experience I can easily go there uh, go to drivers check for updates and if there is an update for me I can download and install it I can do it here if you're using KMD I believe there is AMD Radeon app to that uh, super similar to GeForce Experience or simply you can go to device manager and then look for display adapters, right click on it, update driver, and search automatically for drivers. So when you update your operating system and your GPU drivers, then you need to restart your computer and look if the problem persists or not. And if the problem persists, the other thing that I suggest you to do here is to verify your game files. So maybe your files, uh, game files is corrupted. So uh, what you need to do here on Steam, you need to go to a library, then you need to go to your game, right click on it, properties, uh, then installed files and verify integrity of the game files. If you're using Battle.net, what you need to do here is on Battle.net uh, as well, find the game. I don't have it uh, Call of Duty on Battle.net, but it will be uh, similar to this, basically the same. You just need to press on the Koga icon once you're on Call of Duty, and then you need to press scan and repair. And the third method that I suggest you to do here is to close uh, background apps and uh, overlay programs on your uh, computer because uh, it can contradict the game. So just go to task manager and end all the tasks that you don't use when you, while you play the game, for example, Google Home or others, and then make sure to uh, disable uh, overlay apps as well or overlays because uh, with the graphic settings, it can uh, corrupt uh, the game and the game will not launch. So Steam has overlay, uh, Discord has overlay, uh, GeForce Experience has overlay, uh, streaming so softwares like OBS or others has overlay. So simply, for example, uh, the most common should be Steam. So you just need to go to Steam, then uh, press on the settings here. And once you're on the settings, go in game and then uh, disable Steam overlay. Uh, you can do the same on Discord, uh, GeForce Experience, you just need to go here, uh, settings, and then uh, disable in-game overlay. And for some people, it should fix their problem. The game is not launching on startup. And the next method that I suggest you to do here, if the game is not working for you, is to reinstall, but without downloading anything. And let me show you how you can do that. Right, so first of all, you just need to find Call of Duty. Uh, first of all, I will show you on Battle.net, and then I will show you how you can do that on Steam as well. So on Battle.net, first to uh, find Call of Duty, press uh, cog icon here, and show in, floor, uh, in uh, Explorer, right? And then uh, select program files here and here you should see your call of duty folder so you just need to rename it to whatever you like here let's make it to uh, just add one and then you just need to close file explorer then you need to completely exit battle.net and then you need to again open up battle.net uh, we need to wait for a couple of seconds and then if we go on games, as you can see here, it should be uh, installed, right? So do not click uh, installed. You, you just need to press locate the game and look uh, where the folder that you change name is. So for me is program files x86, I believe. And then here should be Overwatch. And you just need to, uh, as you can see here, rename it to the uh, previous name right press continue press yes uh, select folder uh, and then you just need to hit update and after it's updated you can play the game uh, once again right and then let me know if this method work for you or not if you're using battle.net and on steam what you need to do here 
what you need to do here is to go to library, then find Call of Duty, right click on it, go to properties, then install files and browse, right? And Call of Duty should be uh, something similar to this, Call of Duty HQ, and then you just need to go on common, then here it should be Call of Duty HQ folder, also rename it, right? Rename it, then uh, what you need to do here next is to go back on Steam, and just hit uh, properties manage and uninstall right hit uninstall and then what you need to do here next is to hit install uh, select your disk and then pause right uh, let's wait for a few seconds here yeah then pause and if we open up the file explorer uh, we can see that our uh, game should uh, our uh, steam should f basically have uh, another folder with uh, call of duty hq right as you can see here right so there is two folders uh, previously saved files call of duty hq and the newly uh, created folder so go uh, on the folder folder that you renamed uh, then you just need to press ctrl a and x right and then uh, what you need to do here next is to uh, go to uh, the newly created folder and paste it all the files here, right? Uh, so as you can see here, it will take it will take us a couple of seconds to basically move files. And then what you need to do here is to go back on Steam, go to install, and then select drive. And now it should validate. A our files and as you can see here it's not validating not downloading and it's after it's validated you just need to wait for a couple of uh, seconds maybe restart your computer and look if the problem persists or not and if the problem persists the last thing that i suggest you to do here is to reset your game settings so on search you just need to open up a documents right and then here you need to look for Call of Duty. It's just your game settings, files, your FUVs, your resolution, and your other player stuff. So what you need to do here is to rename uh, this folder uh, again, and then launch the game, and your uh, 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 every setting will be uh, reset, right? So uh, then you just need to look if the problem persists or not, uh, and then. If the problem do not persist, then you just need to uh, look, uh, uh, everything is working all right, and then just play the game. Right, so that's pretty much it, what I wanted to show you. If I help you out, please press like button, and also if you want to get uh, other method, how you can fix this problem, I will leave the link in the description below, showing you other steps, how you can achieve that if the game is not launching. So yeah, that's pretty much it, if I help you out. Please press like button and subscribe for more.